Hello, hello, YouTube. All right, uh, bear with me here. I'm doing this video without a viewfinder. So if you find that something is out of frame, that is why. This is being shot on an iPhone right now until uh, I am able to upgrade, but that's besides the point. Today I wanted to do a review. You see the title, you probably know what it is already, right? It is the Emerson Barracuda. This is from the Signature Series. Um, if you look finely on the blade, you can see that it is in fact engraved with Ernest signature. Now, I do like how faint that is on there. Um, it's not like a billboard, so that's very appealing to me. But let's go ahead and get into the knife. Um, the first thing that stands out to me about this blade are the ergonomics. And uh, that can be said for almost every Emerson knife that I own. Almost, no, every Emerson knife I own. I've never picked up an Emerson for that matter and thought, wow, this just doesn't feel very good in my hand. I don't think that's a thing. It's almost like he looks at that first and foremost. Um, the blade shape on this guy is very interesting. I love that very subtle Tonto point. It almost looks rounded if you're not, uh, if you're not careful. Almost looks rounded. Uh, I love the grinds. Ernest, man, I mean, just wicked blade profiles. The lines on this knife are really attractive. And once again, insanely ergonomic. This is one of the standoff versions. Uh, everything I believe he made from 2013 forward will have standoffs. I prefer the uh, the backspacers aesthetically, but I, I do understand that the standoffs are probably gonna add a little more rigidity to the knife. Um, the blade profile, or the overall profile of the knife, it's got a really nice blade to handle ratio in the sense that the blade, it's almost like the, uh, I would compare it to the 0630. If you all are familiar with the ZT0630, I actually have a uh, video posted on the 0630 if you'd like to take a look at that blade, or you can Google it. It's very similar in size and ratio, actually, to the 0630. Um, this is a single D10 offering from Emerson Knives, and what I mean by that is most Emersons have a D10 on the liner, which is not the detent that actuates, and then they have a detent on the opposite side of the lock. The detent on the opposite side of the lock is the one that locks the knife. This guy here just has a single detent on the lock bar side, and that allows it to be very, very smooth. I mean, this thing is ridiculously smooth. It shoots out of there like a rocket. Um, the wave is very reliable on this guy as well. I don't know if you could see just how smooth that is, but it is incredibly smooth. It feels like it's on bearings, uh, truly. It is not. They are on the traditional Emerson Nylatron washers, but this thing feels like it's on bearings. It's very, very smooth. Uh, no lock stick. Very little lock stick. It's it's so trivial. It's not even worth mentioning. Um, I'll show you where the lockup is. I've been using the crap out of this knife. Um, there hasn't been any insane wearing. It's it's almost it's about dead center, about dead center of the tang of the knife, which is where I'd like it to be. So very nice in that aspect. Came pretty sharp from the factory. These are all things that you want to know before you grab a knife. Uh, the jimping, the jimping up here is not like some of the faux jimping we get a lot of the times from Emerson where it's almost just there and doesn't do much. This jimping really does serve a purpose, gives you some pretty damn good traction. I love how easy it is to adjust the pivot. As you can see, you could stick a coin in there, let your imagination figure that one out, which you could fit in there, damn near anything. Uh, yeah, I mean, I don't know 
what else to say about this guy. I love the knife. It is a really good example of an Emerson. Um, bullet points, the fact that it is a single D10 offering, the fact that it is a signature series nice, knife, excuse me, the blade to handle ratio is on point, buttery smooth, and an overall attractive and very useful nice. Knife, why do I keep doing that? <laughs> I guess because it's nice, right? All right, guys, that'll be it for this one. Again, this is the Emerson Barracuda from Emerson Knives, and it is a signature series blade. I'm out.